What is going on, you beautiful, lovely, wonderful, untamed human beings? How are you all doing today? Welcome to the channel. My name is Danny, and I am here to entertain and maybe possibly give you some information on whatever game I may be playing at that time. So today, what I'm going to try to do is get my farm going. We're playing Stranded Deep again. It's been a hot minute since I've played it, like as far as like recording goes. It's going to start working its way into regular rotation. Shout out to all the comments recently, by the way, on on the channel i appreciate that i love it thank you very much we are at 467 subscribers that is phenomenal you guys are blowing my mind we're trying to hit 500 let's get there we're we're getting really close and we keep pushing on a daily basis i don't want to say i have a set time but all videos will be after 4 20 p.m if not by 4 20 p.m eastern standard time so let's get into this right here today we're going to try to build a farm in our beautiful lovely island oasis home slash place we're gonna be hunters look at our shadow we, we, we beautiful we beautiful you know that we're beautiful all right so let's uh I, I need to explore these boats we need to get some exploration done on this bad boy and uh yeah so let's go ahead and get on into it and try to hopefully find the things we need so let's go ahead and check our stuff arming so i guess we're gonna make one of these plots actually should we make a wooden plank plot or should we make a corrugated i think corrugated farming is what we're gonna do we need only two pieces of metal and yeah i think we already have that we just don't have it in our inventory so we're gonna go ahead and find our metal i think it's in one of these chests i'm not exactly sure which one we don't need rope we need it oh that's what we can do as well we can expand upon our raft in this episode i don't know i don't know if there's gonna be any plots of potatoes or not on this freaking plane or this area this lovely wonderful area that i created um if y'all don't didn't know this island i uh made this island myself and kind of slapped it into the game you want to check that out i'll leave a link at the ending of the video or in the description to the video where i built this island so what i'm doing first i need to build focus danny focus focus daniel san focus you got the focus you got to go check your boxes and see if you have your your, your metal there's our other piece of corrugation like I said, my primary goal today is going to be getting this farm at least set up, like built partially. Because I don't have the supplies just yet to start really fully getting the farm properly together. So let's go ahead. Make us a farm in peace right here. Why don't you make that? Oh, I gotta use a hoe. Oh, I forgot I had to make a hoe. Oh, no. I need to make a hoe. I think I have one, don't I? Or did I leave it on one of my islands? I might have left it on one of my other islands. So let's just make one then. Tools, tools, tools. Alright, so I have the rope. I just need the stones. Oh, speaking of which. Put these. Get these out of my inventory. Get rid of this coconut. Organization is key. We're playing this, by the way. Helps dramatically. Pick up that. And grab one of these. Ribbit. Now we can make ourselves our hoe. Now we can go ahead and make our plot of farm. Farmable land thinking maybe right here that looks like a good spot all right so that'll be our main little farm piece now i need to go find potatoes because i need to make quite a few things to be honestly starting with a fuel still i need to make one of these bad but i need a lot of stuff quite frankly that's gonna be like one of our first steps to making things like complete i guess what we could do as well is make our raft a little bit bigger i think that might be the play as well so oh, these waves look wild wow why are these waves so big today oh strange the waves are massive right now bumping into rocks and stuff all right we're just kind of floating around over to our home base 
But it's so crazy, it looks like the our base is on the water, even though it's really not. There we go. Now we got our boat over here by the house. A little bit of water there, I guess. Let's go ahead and get ready to call it a night. I don't know why my homeboy has to wake up at like 5.30 in the morning in the game. Homie is like always up before the sunrise. I guess early bird gets the worm, but still. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go get our water topped off and our food possibly topped off. We need to start bringing some stuff over here to eat. So I might build out here, just build this out a little bit more. That way I can <coughs> put a way to cook right over here. Look at this. What more could I ask for? Look at that. Beautiful. So I'm debating on whether I want to go to that island out there or whether I want to not go to that island out there. I don't need to at the moment, but I feel like I want to. All right, so let's go ahead and see how many more parts I can actually make. Let's see if I can make my front of my raft. Rid of that, rid of that, that. I got a hoe. Anyways, this is why I want to use this little cove right here. So I'll lock her in, and now I can actually build right here on the edge. So let's go ahead. Craft this. Craft another one. Alright, so we're a little bit longer. That's going to help a lot. Can we add another one? There. I got to move it a little bit. A little, little cheesy tactic. For some reason, the way items connect, like if I put this down here and I go under it, and then up, I can lift it up even though that it's, you know, anchored. Same thing goes for dragging it out like that. Now my anchor, look out, look at my anchor, it's all stretched. Normally you can't move the raft when it's anchored, but if you have an object that you're carrying like this, you can move it. So I can take it, I can push it like that. Looks like there's a storm coming in. Nothing unusual. Push it out like so. All right, now bring this down. Now my raft looks like it's out in the right spot. I'll pick that back up. Put that in my inventory. Jump back on my raft. And now I can actually make that part. This will help with stability. Making my my raft look like a, a, like a fighter ship. But it's all good. We're, we're, we're popping it. We're wide in this bad boy. Alright, so let's go ahead and get some more wood. This stuff I'm gonna move over towards the house in a bit. But at the moment, we'll just leave it over there. All right, uh, we don't need to set that up for crafting. So let's go ahead and, you know, is my alt set to anything? I might change that. That's what I might do. Ah, there we go. I forgot I had to go way down to the bottom. C, C just doesn't, doesn't work for me in this. There we go. Now we're good. That makes things a lot easier. I mean, X or Z would have been good too, but I think alt. Is the way to go. That's uh, one plot. So we need to get potatoes. We've got this rolling right here. That's lovely jovely. We've got some new parts. Which makes our raft more stable. But also kind of makes our raft a bit bigger and more unwieldy. I need more wood. You know what? We're going to go look for potatoes. I need potatoes, 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 potatoes. And I think I know which island we're gonna go to. This one, straight across from our house. Even though it is an island that looks like it has, um, oops, Jesus, rocks right there. Even though it's an island that looks like it has possible like boars and wildlife. We're still gonna go over there for two reasons one it's not that far so we gotta see our stuff and two we need to get potatoes or potentially find potatoes what the heck is that looks like the top of something gotta watch out though oh crap I was dumb. I didn't come here with any water, did I? Nope, but at least I'm close enough to the house. 
Uh, I'll starve or die first. Let's see if we can find potatoes. I also gotta watch my back. Because I know there's snakes here. There's boars. Ah! Oh, couldn't have been any better. Oh my goodness, look at that. Cool. That's all I really needed from here. Now I need to head back to the house and start planting potatoes. I'll put these in the crate and go from there. This is lovely. I love it. That was a good island to go to. Any islands with rocks on them like that usually have wildlife and potential dangerous wildlife. Large crabs, boars, snakes, things like that. So usually you want to just stick to islands that don't have any sort of um, rocks on them when you first start. After you, of course, ah, I hit a rock, speaking of rocks. Um, gosh darn it. Stuck on a rock. Meh, it's not that big of a deal, actually. Well, we're still in the cove, so... Oh, that was close. I almost stepped on that. That would have been bad. So we're not worried about water and stuff now. We're back at our main base. Food would be nice, but water is here, so we're at least good in that department. We did get potatoes on that last journey, so that's one less thing to worry about. Speaking of water, I actually need water in the real world. We got crabs. Uh, smoked meat. I forgot I have that. We need that. That's We need that now. All right, we're looking better. Every second, we're looking better. So just to catch everybody up, if you're new to the channel and you're just now catching into this series on this channel, I'm going for an entire year of survival. So I'm trying to get 365 days completed before I actually try to escape this entire ordeal. Um, this game's been around for a while. If you know what the escape is, you know what the escape is. That's really all there is to it. Um, yeah, so that's a ting. All right, so some of that meat's already cooked. Let's go ahead and just eat, eat, crank up, put out the fire. All right, is there anything we can put down? Nope. So let's head back to the house and get some rest. For now, we'll wait. We'll do some more stuff in the morning. We'll probably try to plant those potatoes. We'll gather some water. Water that. I need to create a either a another coconut flask, or I'll see about creating a water skin, which is another method of being able to drink water. So hold, save the game, sleep. All right. Finally, homeboy actually slept until six something in the morning. Good to know. Good to know. I'm glad. I'm glad you can get some sleep, my friend. So actually, let's go over here and grab our potato. We're gonna start setting up one of our farms. We can actually make another plot and possibly grow something else. This will be. Ooh, I, I really gotta avoid that for sure. All right, let's go ahead and drag this out around like that. Go ahead and turn it over here into this like little shallow spot. Hey, there's my crab that I can eat. I forgot I got my crabs over here. We got crabs, everybody. Okay, we might make us another plot. I think I have to water the plots anyways. Oh, it's got zero durability. We're good. <clears throat> Before I can plant anything. So I'm going to have to create... Plant the patata. Patata corrugated farming. Sweet! Alright, let's go fill the water up. Is that. That. And then we want to come over here. With our coconut flask. Collect. Can't hold any more water, so we're gonna go ahead. Wait, can we drink it? Yes, we can. Grab this. I can only hold one thing of water. Alright, good to know. So we can do at least one and then come back. I need to bring that water stuff over here closer to begin with because then we can boom hit the water we're gonna have to do that until it's full and i think that will allow us to get our patitas going which is the start where we're reaching self self sustain self sustainability that was hard for me to say <laughs> oh we ran out of stamina i was wondering why we slowed down but it's good to know that we can at least fill up three 
fill up the coconut. Or I can make more coconuts. I didn't think about that. I could have just made four coconuts and then carried them over and just watered it with each. I think you can make a water bladder, which I believe also holds more. Hey, day 56. All right, so our potatoes are half watered. Um, Let's go ahead and see what that entails. So I did say we can make a water bladder, which means we also need to make a few other things. I love it. It's great. I love having to craft all sorts of tins. We need to make us one of them tannin rocks right here. So we need four pieces of wood and four tins of twine. I have the wood, actually. I just gotta go get it. And I can make plenty of um, twine and whatnot. Hey, give me that. Thank you. So there should be wood on the other side of this plane. Somewhere around here. Oh, there's some wood. Yes, I do. I was gonna say, do I have my axe with me? I hope I do. Eight, four. Let's go ahead and grab this yucca. 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 All right, pick up, pick up. Thank you. All right, there's some stuff to make rope. Two, three, four. Now we need to make a tanning rack. We're going to put that over by our hut. <clears throat> Possibly in our hut, to be honest with you. Tanning rack. Yes, I can. We're going to put it right there. Ah, yes, sir. We're off to it. We can almost make a water bladder now. That's perfect. I just need leather and wood. And I think, I think I might have some of that leather somewhere. Do I need the water bladder? Nah, not really. Am I going to make it? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Rawhide from a shark or wild boar can be crafted into leather at a tanning rack. Beautiful. All right. So we're off to good. We're off to good grind out. We're, we're set. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. We got our tanning rack out there. We got our farm started. Oh, there's a potato starting to form. <gasps> Look at it. It's a little potato. It's starting to form. We're going to get potatoes. All right, we made two things of leather. We can make ourselves a water thing. Uh, why? Why do I have too much stuff in my inventory? Come on now. So I'll be hunting more sharks. That's good to know. I'll definitely want to make more shark hides and take more shark hides and create some things out of it. So far, we've successfully set out to do what we wanted to do today, which is awesome if you ask me. We need that wood. We're about to make a water skin. We're gonna make a water skin so that we can hold on to some water. Right. Boom, we got some water skin. I love it. I love it. We're all, we're freaking working it, man. Uh, that's supposed to be rope. I messed that up. I almost put stuff in there that didn't need to be in there. Go ahead and take these out. Go ahead and drop this and that in there for now. Cool. Let's go set up our water so that it starts getting water again. All right, skin that seagull. Oh, that gave me a big chunk of meat. Oh, never mind. It was a small meat. The an the animation for it was just not appropriate. All right, whatever. Drop that right there. I think I should hunt for a little bit. Because I need more food. Oh, a pee, pee plant. I didn't know I had that. I could also grow that, too. I'm probably going to make a box labeled just for farming stuff. All right, so while I'm waiting for all that, I figured I'd come out here and... Oh, basking cart. Come here. Come here. I can't attack you? Oh, that's lame. What about you? Can't attack you neither? That sucks. <laughs> I guess there's some limitations. What about the turtle? Can I get the turtle? Oh, nope. Can't attack the turtle. Well, you can't attack none of those things. I'm learning new things too myself, to be honest. Right now, we've been just kind of hunting. Grabbing some sardines. I mean, they're they're good for little foods and trinkets. You really want the bigger stuff, but right now it's what I've got, so that's what I'm doing. 
I'm looking for potential potential rocks and things like that like clay I need clay it's just a matter of where it is ah! he scared me <laughs> I thought it was a bigger shark I, I tripped I'm tripping how we got what we got is our food cooked? It is. Go ahead and eat that. Drink, drink. <laughs> There's nothing in our smoker. Unfortunately, it's tapped out. We have a water skin now, so we can bring water with us when we go to other islands. Instead of using our coconut flask, which is only one drink anyways. I think the water skin is like four. <clears throat> We'll find out because we'll fill it up in the morning and then we'll set some water in our just like our water collector and we'll make that. Whoops, I fell. All right, everybody. If you enjoyed this episode, then smack that like button. Consider subscribing to the channel if you want to see more of this content. Today, we actually managed to get our farm set up. We made a water skin. We crafted a, 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 a tanning rack. Uh, we're, we're doing some things. We're getting some things going. We also made some more floors to the raft. We avoided uh, being stung by those sea urchins. And yeah, really, it's just we got to keep progressing from here. This Friday, Friday, we're going to go ahead and we're going to explore that boat together so peace and love everybody i will catch you on the next episode slash stream tomorrow i'm gonna be dropping bloodborne so stay tuned for that and i will catch y'all later see ya